Hi guys, welcome to another episode of the series of the ABCs of Success series. And thank you so much for joining us today. We are coming to you live from all around the world and we are online business coaches and mentors helping people to achieve success in the online space with online businesses. And we are here to share some tips and strategies with you for success in life and success in business. And so today we come to you with the letters Q, R, S, and T. And my letter is Q, and the word that I chose is question. And that is because when you're starting an online business, I really believe that you need to ask the right questions. When I started this business, I came in with no experience at all. And I had tried a couple of other online businesses, and I really failed at those because I didn't have the support that I needed. And so now that I've been doing this business for over two years, I know the kinds of questions that need to be asked. And so if you ever are looking to start an online business, some questions that might be good to ask are, um, will I have personal coaching and mentorship when I um, go through my training if I need support? Um, how long will it take me to go through the training? What format will the training be in? What is the training like? And can someone be successful in this business with no experience? I think that's a really important question because a lot of businesses out there require you to have some former experience. Um, another question is, how many hours per day do I need to, to spend running my business? And in our business, most people spend two to three hours per day um, on their business and they have good results. So I hope that's helpful for you um, if you ever decide to start an online business. And next we will go to Georgia with the letter R. I've got to take myself off mute. Um, yeah, so hi everybody. And thank you for that, Rachel. Um, I chose the word real for the letter R. So this is a very important word in my life and in our community. And I kind of been brought up to see things as, okay, this is real. This is, this is cool. This is, you know, the way it should be. And, um, in, in my life, I've always looked at things like, you know, is this, is this real or is this shady? Is it no good? And in our business, we have a real community. It's a real legit business. There's so many things out there right now in the online world that is not what it seems to be. And even in the whole world, there's a lot of things out there that, you know, it's false advertisement and um, people aren't who they seem to be and you don't live with them or, you know, they don't act real or whatever the case may be. But in our community, in our online business community, I have met some of the most realest, genuine, sweetest people in the whole entire world. And there, some of them are sitting here today. And this business is so incredible. Everything that was given to us, and handed over, and you know, you receive tax slips, you, it's legit. Um, so to me, that's the, it's very important to talk about uh, the word real today. And you know, whatever it is in your life that you're going through, and you know, you're, you, you're not unsure about whether it's legit or whether it's the right decision or is this real or is this person real? Is this business real? Is this a real opportunity? Go with your heart, go with your feeling. You'll know it. You'll, you'll feel something because I have felt something in this amazing community. So we're keeping it real in our online business and the ABC success series today. So we're going to go to Rose. What? the letter um, S. All right, thank you for that, Georgia. So my letter, this, uh, I chose this simple and short and very significant letter for me because uh, it really helps me in, in my life. So my letter is S, um, S for season. So in Ecclesiastes 3, it says that in everything there is a season. So uh, whatever your, like your situation now, if you are uh, in, in a bad situation or low point of your life, uh, don't worry. Remember that it will never last. And um, if your business is not, uh, or if your business is going to the wrong direction or the other side, so uh, just remember it's just a season. Like, and, and it really helps me a lot because during, um, it really reminds me this word uh, during the time when I was in the low point of my life and I was really broke. And uh, I'm so blessed that I knew the word, this meaning of season. 
because I knew that uh, whatever in, in, in my situation that time, I knew that it, it's not permanent and it's just a season. And I knew that uh, the season for me to flourish, to become uh, good, uh, it will come. And uh, whatever situation you are now, just always remember, never make a permanent decision when you have a problem because it's always a seasonal. And uh, I'm so blessed now. I can say that I'm the peak season of my life because I found this digital business. And it really helps me. It helps me grow. I, I And uh, it helps me a lot of people and just always remember in everything you do, it's just a season and, and, and every day, it's just a, a season for a new beginning, a season for a change. And this is the season that I am proud that I can inspire a lot of people and uh, I can bless a lot of people. So thank you so much. And let's move on to Cherie with letter T. Awesome. I think I'm unmuted now. Okay, so I had the letter T today, and I would like to bring the word training uh, to the group. And I just wanted to start by um, something that I tried to remember, and I also try to uh, remind people that I'm mentoring that are starting this business, that every single professional, every single expert, every person that's seen success in their life has all started as a beginner in whatever it is, whether it be sport or whether it be a hobby, whether it be painting, whether it be business. Everyone started at the start somewhere and they got to where they are before, uh, to where they are now, sorry, because of training, basically. So it is what changes what you're doing from being in something you're interested in to actually something you're pursuing and something that you're reaching out for. Uh, it is that extra commitment that you give towards what you're what you're doing. Uh, we are very, very fortunate in the business that we have chosen uh, that we have such incredible training available to us. Uh, I don't think any one of us would have been um, aware when we started of just how great it is and how ongoing it was going to be. Uh, when I started about 20 months ago, we it was very good training then, but it has advanced incredibly since. So they keep adding to the training. They keep updating the training because, as we know, we all work in social media and it's always changing. And every platform that we work on and work with is always changing. So we have an incredibly committed group of people behind the scenes that are helping us as business owners to keep that training up to date and and thorough we actually just um got added pinterest training which is really exciting so some people don't wouldn't think that pinterest is something that you would need training on but uh we're so grateful that we don't have to go out and spend all this money on expensive courses and um endless time Googling and hoping that we're finding the right information because we have people that have already gone out there and done that for us. They found the, the best way to do our business and it's available for you when you, when you start your business. So I uh, just wanted to touch back with, with how I started. Everyone starts as a beginner. I started as a beginner in this business. I had no interest in being online. I had no, um, I wasn't searching for this uh, whatsoever. I stumbled completely into this. Uh, but with the training, that's what's got us there. And I have people that I work with that were completely um, without any tech savviness whatsoever. And they were basically like, I am not going to be able to do this. And I just said, yes, you can, because we have the training and we have the mentorship. So uh, that's my tea. And that's what I want to kind of end with. So thank you guys for having me on once again today. Thank you so much for joining us, Cherie, again. And uh, thank you to all of you that are watching. Thank you for joining us. And I hope you join us next week for another episode of the ABCs of Success series. And have a wonderful evening, morning, day, wherever you are. Bye, guys. Thank you. Bye.